Hello fans green, corn or corn kernels are common in local markets. Known locally as Ibagori, it can be purchased for 100 Rwandan francs per piece, grilled or boiled. If you want to prepare it at home, you can also eat it raw. Everyone will be advised to add corn to their diet. Why? Nutritionists say that there are various nutritional benefits that are important for our well-being. These nutrients include fiber, which aids digestion, as well as folic acid, thiamine, phosphorus, vitamin C, and magnesium. According to Rene Tabaro, a nutritionist at one of the leading hospitals in Arabia, corn is high in antioxidants and provides the calories needed for a healthy daily metabolism and is also a rich source of vitamins A, B, E and many other minerals. It is known that corn is rich in vitamin E, a natural antioxidant that is essential for growth, and is also a rich source of vitamins A, B, E and many other minerals. It is known that corn is rich in vitamin E, a natural antioxidant that is essential for growth, and protects the body from disease. Because of its high fiber content, when consumed it plays an important role in preventing digestive disorders such as constipation, hemorrhoids, and colon cancer, he said. On the other hand, antioxidants act as anti-cancer agents and prevent Alzheimer's disease. According to a study conducted at Cornell University in New York, corn is a rich source of antioxidants that help fight cancer causing free radicals. This suggests that unlike many other foods, cooking corn increases the amount of usable antioxidants in sweet corn, and it is a rich source of a phenolic compound called ferulic acid, an anti-cancer compound that has been shown to be effective in fighting tumors that cause breast and liver cancer. Tabaro pointed out that corn is also rich in phytochemicals, and provides protection against several chronic diseases. He said the fiber content in corn helps relieve digestive problems such as constipation and hemorrhoids, and reduces the risk of colon cancer. All of this, he says, is because corn is a whole grain. Another important aspect of corn fiber, says Tabaro, is that it helps with bowel movements, which stimulates peristalsis and the production of gastric juices and bile. It can also add bulk to stools that are too watery which can reduce the chance of irritable bowel syndrome and diarrhea, she adds. Dudone Bukaba, Nutrition Program Coordinator for African Humanitarian Action, AHA, in Rwanda, said corn is also rich in B vitamins, especially thiamine and niacin, which are important for maintaining healthy nerves and cognitive function. However, he found that corn is also a good source of pantothenic acid, which is an essential vitamin for the metabolism of carbohydrates, proteins and fats in the body. Bukaba explained that a deficiency of folic acid in pregnant women can cause babies to be born with low birth weight and can also cause neural tube defects in newborns. When pregnant women eat corn, corn provides most of the daily folate requirement, thus preventing this condition, he said. Several studies have shown that corn oil has anti-atherogenic effects on cholesterol levels and reduces the risk of various cardiovascular diseases. Corn oil, in particular, is a great way to improve heart health, and that's because corn has a nearly optimal combination of fatty acids. Additionally, they explain, this allows omega-3 fatty acids to remove harmful LDL cholesterol, or bad cholesterol, and replace it at the binding sites. This reduces the chance of clogged arteries, lowers blood pressure and reduces the chances of heart attacks and strokes. Kigali-based nutritionist Kamenzi says there are different types of corn and yellow is a rich source of beta-carotene, a strong red-orange pigment found in many herbs and fruits, which produces vitamin A in the body, and is essential for maintaining good eyesight and skin. Beta-carotene is an excellent source of vitamin A because it is converted into the amount the body needs, says Kamenzi. However, he warns that vitamin A can be toxic if taken in excess, so lowering it through beta-carotene conversion is ideal. It also promotes healthy skin and mucous membranes, and strengthens the immune system. 
Kamanzi further noted that the amount of beta-carotene in the body that is not converted to vitamin A, like all carotenoids, acts as a very powerful antioxidant and can fight terrible diseases such as cancer and heart disease. So that's important information from corn that everyone might just know about. I hope this video information is useful and adds to your insight. Stay healthy and continue to support this channel by liking, subscribing and sharing. Thank you.